Hey everybody, we are here playing Look at People's Mugshots. It's a new game, just came out on the uh, Xbox Live Arcade, and uh, let's just dive right in. A social game, mugshot.me. Mm. So right now we are looking... Actually, let's go to something else. We are going to be... No, I've not been arrested. We are going to be looking at credit cards. And um, If it loads, it is a bad problem with loading there. Those aren't credit cards. No, this is a bunch of weird people with red and blue shirts. Giving some, giving credit cards some weird designs. I mean, give these guys some credit. They're not credit cards. Oh, oh, yeah. Pretty weird day when a credit cards look like this. So we, here we've got James Lynn Mc, McCary, who changed his appearance from that to, to that. this. Yes. Mm -hmm. So um, and only a matter of what is that? Twenty-two days. Yep. Yeah. In 22 days, that, that's quite a makeover. Mm -hmm. um, the wonders we can do with uh, technology. It's pretty cool. All the credit cards you had to use for that. I bet. So, um... I don't know, let's see. Credit cards are boring. They are very boring. Let's go to, uh... I believe the banks are hurting society, so let's... Should we look at some aliens, or, um... I'm, I'm into some sci-fi stuff. Let's go to aliens. Alright, so... We're going to go to the alien world of mugshots. It's the alien world. Well, this is a ripoff. These are just I... th these are just Mexicans. Yeah, this is kind of lame. This is really lame. I mean, you go to an alien world and you expect aliens. Then you just get Mexicans. What does that have to do with anything? Yeah, that's like one of the big things holding this game back is the alien level. Oh, you're really sharp. So I don't care for it. All right, so should we just go? Here, to I, else? I, I, let's look at these. Um... This must be a difficulty switch because it says uh, menacing. Mm -hmm. So this must be the menacing difficulty. Ah, uh, yeah, these people are pretty menacing. It sent us back. That's how menacing it is. Oh wow! Here we no go. wait, here we, we're back again. All right. Okay, so so we've got. Look at that menacing silhouette of a person right there. Right here. Yeah. Yeah, and we have. Uh, Michael Gerard Mahar, who, um, uh, is very menacing. What's this guy's name? Joshua David Parrish. Parrish? Where? Parrish. Whoa, that is menacing. That's very menacing. Look at him staring at you wide-eyed, like he's, he's gonna, he's gonna menace the shit out of you. He's really messing me right now. Yeah, I'm menaced. And then we have, um, this guy, Edgar Petrosian, who was arrested a couple days ago. For being menacing. Uh, very menacing. And we've got uh, another bunch of menacing people. I mean, if I saw these guys walking down the street, I would be like, whoa, quit it. You're menacing me. They just menace the hell out of me. Mm -hmm. well, this guy is so menacing, he doesn't even wear a shirt. Oh, shit. Like everyone else, they've got a somewhat menacing shirt on, but this guy. He doesn't like, need it. He's already kind of off Christ. center. Yeah, off center, menacing. Anyway, I'm a little too menaced out right now. So let's go to something a little less menacing. Uh, how about prostitution? Want to look at some prostitutors? This must be the adult mode. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Kind of weird turn they took with this. Yeah, I like how it appeals to all ages. I mean, you've got this for the adults, and then you have like, oh, look at this handsome fellow right here. Ah. I'd take some prostitution from him. I know. Uh, I'm more into that that large black man <laughs> over there. Peel. Peel. Peel Enrique Ebron. I'd peel the fuck out of him. Apparently, he's been arrested for prostitution thirty-six times, so uh, you know he's he knows what he's doing. Yeah, he he's really experienced. Mm -hmm. um, and then we have Javier Umana Moranchel. Man, I already feel raped by his name. Yeah. yeah. Not raped. You bought it. Bought it. I paid for that feeling. Mm -hmm. Ooh, look at this beautiful lady's eyebrows. You can really tell, like... You can um, tell she, something once excited her so much that they just left. Yeah. Obviously. They went up so high that we just never saw them again. And, and so then she we've had to... got Brianna Ray Walters, who is... I don't... You know, one thing I don't like about this mode, um, some of the names get to a pun. Like, right here is uh, Larry E. Hardy. Mm-hmm. But what is the pun there? I don't see it. Oh, it's just a immature thing there. <clears throat> I think they should really class up the humor. Oh, hard? 
Yeah, Hardy. Uh, Hardy. <laughs> nice. <laughs> they need to class up the humor, definitely. Yeah. I'm not in. I don't have the same sense of humor as you. Yeah, this game isn't that great. Yeah. Uh, let's see, how about computer criminals? So it's, we're gonna see some computers. Computer crimes. Yeah, we've got. Whoa, this man. <laughs> what? He's in the wrong section. He's menacing. He's very menacing. <laughs> Is he secret? Jesus Christ. <laughs> What could he do with a computer? He's way too menacing. He can menace the computer to doing whatever he wants. Jesus. Is that him again right there? <laughs> oh, damn. No, that's a different guy. That's No, uh-uh. No, no, see, look, Lowell Noblet. Oh. And there's Lowell Lewis Noblet. He lost his middle name in only a matter of... Yeah, like, this is a public service announcement. We need to stop looking at our computers so much because our eyes will end up like that. Well, then we'll be menacing, which is a plus, so... He's, again, damn, this guy is breaking world records He knows here. how to hold him. Yeah, shit. Menacing and this, stuff. This is his opposite version right there. Gus Glass. Oh, I saw him before. Yeah. I know him. He is we get, right to, we get to know some of these familiar faces in, uh, in this game. Mm -hmm. It was a great day, October 17th, when uh, this menacing man was put in jail. Anyway, let's see. Um... I'm getting a little bored of this game. Yeah, so, final score? Final score, uh... Well, let's see, we have to take into account that the humor was a little dry, especially in the prostitution level, like you said, the, uh, Hardy. It's not yeah, funny. Yeah, yeah. You thought it was pretty funny. Uh, that, I was just kidding. Okay. Um, and so, I would say, like, about... 6.9 out of... Hmm. I don't know. You do the final score. Uh, I'm struggling. I'll give it a 5.74 right. out of 11.21. I'm kind of. Oh, I'm kind of harsh. Yeah, I don't care for this. You know. I can tell. I can tell. Yeah.